Hello friends, welcome to the new session of Oracle SQL Developer Tips and Tricks for Beginners. In this tutorial, we are going to see how to generate AWR report with Oracle SQL Developer. First of all, AWR is nothing but automatic workload repository. By using this AWR report, we can analyze the particular database performance. Say for example, if you are experiencing any slowness or if you are experiencing any performance issue on the database, you can generate uh, AWR report for the particular timing and analyze the report. Uh, what are the queries which are uh, taken high CPU utilization and what are the queries which utilized more time likewise you can uh, find the queries and you can uh, tune those particular queries to generate this AWR report I am going to show you how to generate through SQL developer so open your SQL developer and go to view tab there is a menu called a DBA click here and in the connection wizard click plus and connect the schema you want to generate the AWR report so in my case I have expression edi express edition installed in my local machine so I will show you how to generate with this sys user so I am going to generate AWR with for this sys user so connect the schema you want and click ok so you will be find your new connection over here so extract this sys user and go to the performance tab and extract here and uh, when you extract performance you will be able to find the AWR menu and extract that and click on the AWR report viewer so when you click AWR report viewer you will be able to see one new window open in the SQL developer so from here right start ID and end ID you have to specify on what time to what time you want to generate the AWR report so in my case I am going to generate from 19th Jan 12 AM to and snapshot ID 12 Jan 20th 4:38 pm. So once you have selected uh, start ID and end ID, so you will be you, this button will be, will be enabled. Click here, and Oracle SQL Developer have successfully generated the AWR report. So if you want to save this report, right? Click here. There's a save button here, and you can save wherever you want. I'll name like AWR. Save. So th this will generate a HTML report. That's all. Our AWR report has been successfully generated and saved. So this is our AWR report which we have generated now. So from this report, right, you can uh, analyze the performance of the particular database. In the upcoming videos, we will see how to analyze the AWR report. I hope this video is clear enough. If you have any doubt on this AWR report generation, you can leave a comment in the comment section. Thank you so much. If you like my videos, you can subscribe my channel for regular updates. I have uploaded so many useful tricks and tutorials in my channel. You can make use of it. Thanks for watching.